Hello, welcome to the studio. This week is a short and sweet video. I'm just taking you on a tour of my new pieces that are up in the shop, available now. They are small dry points um, and they're inspired by my trip to Skye. If you like the video, then please do click like, subscribe to the channel. Um, there's lots more to see at ruthander.co.uk. You can buy artwork, you can buy video courses all about how to hand print at home. And you can join my newsletter, which is ruthander.co.uk. So these five little pieces uh, were all conceived um, as a response to my trip to the Isle of Skye in March. And they are from slightly different plates. Uh, and they all these little plates were made uh, from plastic, throwaway plastic basically, either milk bottle cartons or tetra packs. And you can see here the line, that's how small the actual plate, dry point plate is. And I've literally scratched into the metal there, sorry, into the plastic uh, with sandpaper I think I used for this bit and just with a sort of uh, dry point needle for some of the rest of it. Um, and the same with this plate here as well. But the reason um, they look quite different from my other ones is that I have printed them with chine collé, which is basically collage, uh, straight through the press. Um, and I've allowed the chine collé and the collage to go right over the edges, as you can see, um, which I really like. Um, so they've also then had some extra collage put on afterwards, like this piece here, and some drawing as well, like that line. Um, add a little bit of mono print as well. So yeah, I really enjoyed playing around with going over the edges essentially, um, not worrying that the edge of the printing plate could be seen, which I think is sometimes something that printmakers don't want to do. Um, but I actually really enjoyed that. I liked the colour seeping out through the edges. Um, and uh, these papers, these collage papers, were made, they're tissue paper and they're printed on with oil paint. Now, if you've seen any of my other videos, you'll see how I do that. And some of these are just happy accidents. They're ghost prints. Um, so, you know, things that I didn't really mean to print or, you know, whatever. And I have a big pile of those and they then go get cut up and put into prints like this. So, um, that's how these were created. I love the dry point, the scratchy line, and actually the plastic plates, I think, actually rival the metal plates as well. Um, you get these lovely scratchy lines. Often you can do some lovely wiping work as well on plastic plates because they're so kind of shiny and smooth, which means you can do sort of a little mono print as part of your print. Like I've done a little bit of that there. So these are currently available on my shop, my online shop. Uh, so just go and have a look. The link is in the description. <laughs> 